Hi guys. Hi Fionn. Crawling, speech feeding, vision, are they related? Yes. So, where you're not getting help is because you have the crawl. The crawl looks good to the layman. Crawl's too small, slow from what you're showing me. Kids need balance, they're quicker. You know what I mean? That The crawl is quicker. This kind of cautious crawl, I think goes back to the vision. The delays in speech and feeding. I'm gonna tell you this, guys. I can feed you the best meal, what filet mignon, whatever you think it is, crab lobster, whatever is your jam. If I came in behind you and just stuck it in your mouth, you'd want to hit me. When you don't have vision around food, it is very, very violent. Um, and the same thing with speech. If I say this is five, right? But it's five right now, but is it five? You know what I mean? Depending. And so when you have a hyperopia, right? You're getting this. So your eyes play tricks on you. And I love when people say it's neurological. Of course it's neurological because your eyes aren't structured to see. So we both know, you and I both know that there's a hyperopia. So so it's it's not that the eye comes in and I do it with my right eye. It's actually going up a little bit, right? So that's where you get the hyperopia. And then that is still, again, I, crawling is real slow and laborious because it's like, ooh, Ooh, the depth perception is totally off. And that's where you're having the complications. He's smart trying to figure out around it, but he's trying to do a lot trying to figure out around it. And that's what we're trying to prevent. So that's what you need to do. Um, I know you're struggling to get this eye examination done. Uh, my trick is is calling up the eye doctor. Ooh, boo -hoo. Ask for the office manager. You know, my baby's not progressing, you know, this, that, and the other versus, oh yeah, they're crawling, every, you know, they're not going to hear, they're not going to hear the wants and needs um, that you're trying to project out. Meanwhile, I would do the all fours course and so forth, but work on that or the head and the vision course to see if we can head. But see, the problem is the eyes turning into an astigmatism, you need glasses. If the eyes turning in because it's neuromuscular, then we need to start patching but I can't I can't advise you without the report on something especially with the hyperopia that it's going up um, it's not about worrying about your FCP you need to work on the development you have to work on your motor skills your development this crawl should have been down at eight months started to be reaching over reach starting to go up to the couch these kind of things versus the cautious but the cautious is around the vision that doesn't mean you can't be working on movement lessons and doing some simple exercises to just stimulate it so it's more successful and so forth. But um, we really need to know where the vision is at and that's your hang up. But you're gonna have movements that you think are more involved due to the vision because they are more involved due to the vision and that's your hold up there. Maybe he's not the only eye doctor in town, try different ones, you know, even you know, go right off to an optometrist for just a, a retinoscopy, but, but I would be on it. And I know you are, and this is the frustrating part. So that's, that's why those are where it's all succincting in. Thanks.